Hey YouTube. Um, so what I've got here is a CRT TV, and these wires here go to the horizontal axis of the deflection coil on the TV, and the vertical I've just got connected down there. You can see the other two wires in the um, plug right there have been taken out. Most TVs you need like a dummy coil to trick it into thinking there's a coil there um, so it turns on. Not this TV either. It'll run without the deflection coils connected so I've just got the vertical deflection coil connected how it should be and the horizontal is my signal input which is going into a little amplifier thingy that I made and a 8 volt battery which is probably putting out about 3 volts at the moment I've just got this speaker on the signal side not on the actual output of the amplifier just the input so this speaker is running off the power of the phone this is just my old phone very old phone I have had it for years, in fact I, I lost it for a whole year and just found it not long ago so I'm just using this for experiments see through it was pretty cool when I had it but it's slow it's very slow there it is there see through that was pretty cool. But, um, yeah. So I've just been using that for music. I'm surprised it still works. Going through there. Straight into the input of the amplifier. And there's the output, which should go to the speaker, but instead it's just going here. Um, one thing. If you're going to do this, ground ground the def um, horizontal deflection coil wires just in case. I've got it grounded because I didn't have it grounded earlier and I got zapped.
Thank <laughs> you.